back. So now we're going to get down a little more into the, the hips. And we'll start off. And just bring your feet on up. And cross ankle over knee. Do a little hold under your foot and under your knee. And pull up towards you. I'm going to be getting a stretch in my right glute and get the extensors back there. And in this position, we can also go back to the lateral flexions. So if I can bend my lower back left, that's going to open up my right hip more. I can also do right flexion. Gives me a little medial pressure. A little stretch up the inside of my right leg. So you can have the left and right flexion of your L spine while your hips in traction and getting a light stretch. I'm going to switch it over. Ankle over knee. Under your foot, under your knee. Pulling up towards you. You might want to rock this one a little bit. It's nice open here. Breathe and breathe. Again, I can add left flexion. I think kind of nose to toes, although I'm not that close to nose to toes. And go right out of the right side the left flexion, and go right flexion, opening up that left side. Inhale, exhale. Excellent. And this is another nice move for the hip extensors here. You just let your leg head on across. And just hang out here in space and time. A little straighter. Feeling your IT band. A little more bend. Just moving through your hip. Inhale, exhale. Head off to the other side. Really relaxing. Breathe. Inhale, exhale. You can make a little move with this one. It's kind of nice. Kind of like that Parisi warm up move. But just doing it over the roller. Take it to a whole nother level the way you try it. There we go. More coming still?